Even before she ran and leapt across television screens in that red, white and blue bodysuit in the 1970s, Wonder Woman was famous. In 1941, she was introduced as a rare female superhero. Now she's taking on a new role. We are delighted that Wonder Woman is our newest recruit. The UN has made Wonder Woman its honorary ambassador for the empowerment of girls and women. At a ceremony today, the fictional superhero was praised for her commitment to justice, peace and equality. Linda Carter, who brought Wonder Woman to life on television, described her as a role model for girls around the world. All you children out there, Never forget Wonder Woman lives inside you. You can be anything. The United Nations is going to be able to use Wonder Woman's iconic image in their campaigns, but some say this image is exactly the problem. Wonder Woman's attire has been toned down for the UN campaign. Gone is the Americana and her clothing is less revealing, but that hasn't tempered the criticism. Today, some UN staffers turned their backs in protest while others gathered in the hallway holding signs. More than 1,000 have signed an online petition asking the organization to reconsider, saying it's alarming it would use a character with an overtly sexualized image, not to mention that Wonder Woman isn't real. Considering the fact that education is a huge priority of this campaign, it seems pretty terrible to have a, a female character who is literally speechless on this issue. This comes after other concerns were raised at the UN. Just this month, seven women were rejected for the role of Secretary General. And I started reading a lot more Wonder Woman. Um, Even committed Wonder Woman fans like Tanya Gialetti believe the UN made a curious choice. I do agree with the fact that I think we could have picked a real person that would be just as amazing, um, but she makes a great icon. An image can help when you're trying to reach a new audience. I think she's really cool and kick-ass. Not only is the UN trying to raise awareness about female empowerment, but there's also another marketing campaign underway. Today's announcement was a golden PR opportunity for those behind the new Wonder Woman film to promote it and perhaps introduce the character to a new generation. Briar Stewart, CBC News, Edmonton.